what a lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance. Great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the hour or two leading up to it. It has been bumper to bumper, the traffic has been extraordinary, but the level of expectation is also very, very high. And uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing round the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture, well, now they can't wait for it to begin. And begin it will any second now. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. And as you can see, we've already started here. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Well, who else but Hazard? Uh, a slalom-like dribbler who's afforded a certain amount of freedom to stray where he wishes. And He's also a more consistent finisher and, and the sharpest of turners in the box. I'm thinking the same. He will be a central feature, no doubt. For Tongan. That has put a stop to that. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Torgan Azar gets it back. Azar plays it forward. Played out to the right. Trezeguet. Denier. Well, each team knows that they're still well below standard, and it's a question of uh, which can uh, find a way out. Nelly hoists it forward. Witzel. Denier. Tielemans. And it's played forward. Mohamed Salah knocks it away. Turn it in. Oh, what a great leap. He had no right to get to that. De Bruyne plays it short. Well, Red, he sorted that out. Played towards the front men. Brings it forward. Now it's Mohamed Salah. El Mohamedi. Mohamed Salah. Can't get the better of his opposite number. For Tongan. Torgan Azar. For Tongan. And it's Azar. That's great strength on the ball. Torgan Azar. And here's Lukaku. Out to the left it goes. Torgan Azar. And here's Lukaku. It's Lukaku! And it's half time here. From both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. What do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? Well, they look lost for ideas and, and lacking in talent, which all contributes to a, a chronic case of impotence. Egypt head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. Tight, cagey game. Neither team any further forward than they were when they started out. And the game has already resumed here. Egypt can be very glad that half-time came when it did. 
poor possession and very little firepower means they need a serious pickup in this second half. No guts, no glory. De Bruyne floats one over, cut out in the nick of time. It's being played forward. The ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Witzel. Nil-nil still. It's a game that needs a bit of life injected. On Lenny. Up towards the front line. Here it comes. Meunier. Alderweireld. Very little to report from an attacking perspective. Jim, it's a cagey old game. Yeah, I think it's a scoreline in keeping with what we've seen up to this point. Combined attempts at goal aren't high in numbers, and we could do with something to spark this contest into life. Meunier. De Bruyne, Witzel, oh what a ball, Lukaku, Meunier, De Bruyne, Tielemans, De Bruyne, Meunier, Deflected over the goal line for a corner. Belgium are making a change now. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. And he's there to clear it. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. El Mohamedi gets up to head it! Sticks it away! That could turn out to be a huge, huge goal! That is a fine goal, really efficiently done. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. The changes then in quick succession. <laughs> Egypt break the deadlock. Oh, it was a long time coming, but I think it's fully merited. They've applied themselves extremely well. Witzel clips one through. Tries a shot! They've done it! They have grabbed themselves an equaliser! Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Another change here. Belgium grab the equaliser and we're all square. 
Well, I think the players will be buoyed by the fact that they've managed to level things in a hurry. Tails most definitely up now. Tielemans. Alderweireld. Well, what we're witnessing now just goes against the grain. They're not going to get back into the game like this. Bitzel. Tielemans. Ford shows there will be three extra minutes. And it's Witzel. Looking to go deep. 90 minutes up.